Welcome back to Everton 1878. This is breaking news that Everton have completed the signing of X, Leicester City and Hull City. I believe Hull City as well. Uh, goalkeeper Edin Javpolovic. This is any Leicester City fans. Uh, endless City Hull fans. Uh, listen, if any Leicester City fans or Hull City fans. Uh, is, that, is that how you say his name? Because I don't know. But yeah, anyway. Yeah, and yeah. Yeah. Obviously, yeah, on a free transfer, on a free transfer, I believe, as well. Uh, and has signed a short-term contract. He has, shown, he has signed a short-term deal, which again, I think it's, um, you know what, yeah, smart really, you know, he's only, a, I guess, he's only like an emergency backup if, if need be use him. Yeah, uh, um, obviously, yeah, um, yeah. This one, I think obviously, because one, I think obviously, Okay, there's one thing. Uh, obviously, I think, I think the signing of this goalkeeper. I think no, I think it's. I think it's quite interesting. Good because one, well, you know what? I think obviously he's 37 years of age. I imagine he won't get m much game time because one, uh, I can probably see him coming in if a, if you know if Pickford gets in. If Pickford is out injured, or, or get, I think I, you know if I Pickford gets injured or get, I think. This one, I think you know what? I can see. I can actually see him coming. I can actually see him coming. I can see him playing if. Likes of John Pickford is injured or he's ruled out or he's injured injured slash ruled out. I can man, I can see him playing then, but I can see other goalkeepers like Begovic and uh, obviously Andy Lonergan again. He's sadly, I think Andy Lonergan he's one. I think so. You know what? You know what? I think so. Not so. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, so yeah, okay, 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 so you know what it was, all right? I do actually think that. I've, I think the I think the reason why you know I think obviously I think obviously our, our goalkeeper Andy Lonergan I believe he's is was like out injured so again, you know what I think it's I think it's smart I think it's smart that I think it's smart a front man pod and Fowler did go you know what like, you know we need a but you know what I think you know we actually need a like, emergency backup goalkeeper if obviously Lonergan's out uh, Pickford uh, obviously Pickford obviously Pickford is out obviously Pickford's injured obviously pit off John Pickford pits injury up against Liverpool. So yeah, you know what? I think it's smart. I think it's smart intelligent that with that the club and that front line board and fell off done this. So I, I think it's good, you know what? You know, hopefully um so you know I think listen obviously it's very semi use of it. That's not safe. Yeah, so okay, sorry, okay, sorry, okay, sorry, let's go. You know what? Obviously, because one, obviously, he's thirty-seven years of age. Okay, you know what? I, I, I can't see him. I can see him actually. I can see him actually playing, but you know, I'm not really, you know what? Maybe you could, you know, maybe you could play, can't play. You know, we'll see if he actually does. I think if he does play, great. If he doesn't play, you know, he's a bit of a, a coach for a goalkeeper and pick for the half time, you know, so like that. But you know what? I think it's brilliant that you know we've gone out, we've done some, 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 you know, some decent good. Intelligent, smart business like this, so but yeah, you know, I think it's like I think so. I think so. I think like early on in the season, I think it's good that we've done this, but yeah, yeah. Obviously, another news as well. Everton have appointed um, former, I believe he's he's a former. You know, he I think he used to work at the he used to work at the Welsh Association, which is all I think I think does all like the all the young managers likes of Gerard. I think young managers likes of Gerard. Um, I think many other, I think Ian Mars, like I'm a guy, I think like many other young managers have gone through the Welsh, uh, the well, the the Welsh uh, managerial system. Not just not you know through the Welsh managerial association to come managers and yeah, you know what? Obviously, yeah, and you know what? Yeah, I, and it, sorry, okay, sorry, yeah, and also okay, sorry, uh, okay, yeah, and and also I believe that he was at he was at Wrexham. For a, a few good, I think he was at Wrexham for a good time. I think he was a manager at one point, and I think so. You no, know, I think I think he was actually a manager. He was a kind manager at Wrexham, I believe. Listen, right in Wrexham, listen, playing Wrexham fans over there. You know, was he like a manager for you guys? Was he like an a, assistant, or was you know, was he like a, I don't know, a, a director or something there at, at your club? I don't know, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah, obviously, yeah, obviously, yeah, he's been so obviously, yeah, has been. Appointed as being appointed head of academy coaching, which I think is absolute. I think I think I think obviously hearing that you know apparently he's going to be head of the academy coach. I think I think it's brilliant because well, you know what the fact that we got fur right, who was part of the of the Wales of, of, of not was obviously of the Welsh um of the Wales slash Welsh uh, educational like association, which means but you know I felt was you know being through that and then you know. Does well at a, a, a club like so. I, I, I think obviously, you know, obviously, 
So you know, I think like, I've obviously you know doing a, 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 a work club like Rex as well, which I think is brilliant. He's done that, but so you know, I think okay, so you know, I, I do actually think it's brilliant that you know we've gone for someone like him. You know, obviously he knows a bit more about this stuff than than it's not respect but to any other who was probably going for that job. You know, he probably knows more about it than I would, but you know, but yeah, you know what I. Th- Listen, I think it's brilliant that we've done. I think it's brilliant that we've gone. You know, we've got a fellow who knows what he's doing. Listen, you know, I think it's brilliant. We've got a fellow who knows what he's doing at the academy level. Who will, you know, you know, who will be the head of the department of the like, head of the academy coaching, like the head of head head of the academy coaching department. Where you know what, in coaches young, like I think in coaches like these like ex players to come like. To actually become good, you know, to not actually, so not actually, you know, to, you know, to become, you know, to, you know, you know, so they become good young coaches, or they get like these, like you know, listen, don't work, out, listen, I don't, listen, I don't work, listen, I these young coaches don't do well, us, you know, they can go, you know what, we can go and go somewhere else, you know, do that type of thing, you know, go go around somewhere else a little bit, and then go to have it and go, oh, I've done the experience, and I, I want to back here again, and you know, something like that, I think, but yeah, yeah, oh, that was, yeah. And also John Ebrill, the former, of not former, I think obviously the former midfielder, and the obviously I think obviously now, um, obviously now, the I think the the development of the senior coaching staff as well, which I, I think he I think he's remember the development senior um, coaching staff or department. I don't know what it is. Some of that I can't remember what it is, but yeah, you know what I think it's. I think it's brilliant. I think it's absolutely brilliant. We've done that. You know, we thought so if you can know we're looking you know, so I can, so I can, you know, we actually need young upcoming coaches to be good for us and you know, you know what we can actually use them as well as they come in and help the under twenty and under twenty three not so under twenty ones, you know, win a, a title back or something like that, you know. But you know what okay, so you know I think being that, you know, you know, so okay, so you know, I think it's being that, you know, we are looking towards the future by doing what we're doing now, we're getting this uh, Darren, Carl, Darlington, and they're bringing in the goalkeeper. I think, sorry, no, I think I think these two pieces of news are really good, are really good positive news. I think they're really good and positive, positive, positive news. Well, you know, these, I think these two people, we bought a new goalkeeper and bought in a new that was academy coach stuff. Which again, I think it's been smart, intelligent, you know, business. But yeah, you know what? I wonder if guys, let me first come, guys, let me first come slow. Do you think that we have bought the right people to this job? I think we haven't. So. You know, Saying, you know what, guys, let me first come. Do you think we bought in the right P? Do you think we bought right academy of right head of academy coaching? Do you think we should have someone else in or someone better than him or anything like that? You know, also, what's your thoughts on the um, the goalkeeper? Do you think we have signed a good goalkeeper here or a bad one or you know, not very good one or anything, you know, or not a good one or not very good one or anything, you know, anything, you know, anything like that, really, you know, yeah, uh, yeah, go, cool. uh, I said, for us, yeah, you know what, and he wants. He wants listen okay listen okay let's not forget okay, listen also don't forget I'll be doing me starting I'll be doing my, my, my match preview for the Everton versus West Ham game. I'll be doing that on Thursday. I'll be doing that on Thursday. I'll be doing the my starting lemon show for I'm not starting I'll be doing I'll still doing the starting lemon show but I'm afraid that you know what? I'll, obviously I'm doing me my, the match preview for Everton versus West Ham on I'll be doing it tomorrow I'll be doing that on Thursday so and I'm doing me starting show on Friday as well. But yeah. But there you go. Yeah, obviously, if you want to see more good videos like this one, just go to. If you want to see more good videos like this one, uh, and I really appreciate this. I really appreciate if you guys. I really appreciate if you go to. I really appreciate if you guys go. To, I really appreciate if you do give me a follow on Twitter as well. If you want to see more good videos, this one, just go to twitter.com slash everton eighteen seventy eight. Um, I really appreciate if you share it, give a like, leave comments, and if you want to see more good slash great videos like this one, and you want to get notifications and hear about them in the first place. I really appreciate if you guys subscribe to Everton1878 at youtube.com. And also I want to give a massive thanks to everybody who I have now got a le- I've now got eleven subscribers to my channel. So whoever listen, I think whoever not whoever, you know, I think like so I think that to everybody who was I think so I think that to everybody who is is subscribed to my channel. Thank you so so so. I mean when I say thanks so much, I really mean like I really mean this guys like you know what? Seriously guys, thank you. I mean really seriously guys, thank you so 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 much because I think of this channel. I think so. I think of this channel wouldn't be what it is without you guys. Thank you so much. Yeah, see ya.